If you've ever wanted to get track cycling a try, Kenosha is home to the oldest operating velodrome in the U.S. Here's Lance Allen. The sign says it all. Just having the velodrome here in Kenosha is extremely lucky because there's so few of them around the country. Kenosha has the oldest operating velodrome in the U.S., built in 1927. I think it's really interesting and like really cool to be like a part of this kind of history and like coming from a place where like where it originated and seeing it like expand off. I think it's just really a cool opportunity that I have. Carter Kasanovich found his love of the sport through family. When my uncle first showed me cycling, I just thought it was really cool to go fast. Mm -hmm. And you know, I've you know heard of cycling on TV, Twitter France, didn't really know what it was. Um, and I started riding the bike and just riding the track here, you can get up to speeds of 30 or 40 miles an hour. And to me, that's a lot more fun than getting hit in football. Which isn't to say that this sport is for the faint of heart. I mean, I broke my collarbone right over there, actually, and for my first year doing track cycling. So, you know, I think the biggest part of cycling is that you are going to crash at some point, and you just have to learn to get back on the bike, and it definitely helps you, A, in cycling, and A, in life. It's, it's a good life lesson. It's the banking and speed that hooks these competitors. It's exhilarating. It's awesome. It's why I love racing so much that, you know, like knowing that, like, I can do that, I can go 35, miles an hour and it's my body that's making it do that is really cool. This summer night featured competitors young and old and some from speed skating. Now it just needs a little boost. Well, the same community Kenosha is stronger than other cities and I think it does continue to grow when with teams like the Kenosha Cutters and Kenosha Bell Sport, local teams here that try to develop young junior riders to become more a team of the track. Um, I just think that getting the word out and having people notice it more is really important and it'll help the sport grow and you know, the sport does need to grow. It's gorgeous. We'd love to fill the hill more and more as the summer goes on. It's not a bad way to spend a weekday Wisconsin summer night. Lance Allen, TMJ4 Sports.